Understanding, pick up the slack. A guide for English language learners. Hello everyone. In today's video, we're going to explore a common English phrase, pick up the slack. This phrase is used quite frequently in both professional and casual settings, so understanding its meaning and usage can be very helpful in your English language journey. Let's dive in. The phrase, pick up the slack, generally means to do the work that someone else has left undone, or to contribute extra effort when others are unable to fulfill their share of work. It's important to note that this phrase is often used in situations where teamwork or collective effort is involved. This phrase has its roots in nautical terminology. In sailing, slack refers to the part of a rope that is loosely hanging or not under tension. When sailors pick up the slack, they are pulling the loose part of the rope tight. This action is necessary to keep the sails and rigging in proper order. Over time, this term evolved into a metaphor for increasing effort or productivity in other areas of life. To better understand, pick up the slack. Let's look at some examples. 1. In the workplace, if a team member is ill, another colleague might pick up the slack by covering their tasks. 2. In personal life, when one family member is busy, another might pick up the slack at home, doing extra chores or taking care of children. 3. In sports, if a key player is injured, another player might pick up the slack by enhancing their performance to compensate. It's crucial to distinguish picking up the slack from simply helping out. When someone picks up the slack, it implies that there is a deficiency or lack that needs to be compensated for, often unexpectedly or in unplanned situations. It's not just lending a hand. It's filling a gap that has been left by someone else. I hope this video has helped clarify the meaning and usage of pick up the slack. Remember, it's all about stepping up when there's a need for extra effort or filling in when someone else can't complete their part. Thanks for watching and keep practicing your English.